Ooh, someone wants to talk. Is it you? Is it them? Not me, Sal. After this mofo betrayed me, <laughs> the last thing that they're gonna hear is from my lawyer. If you're married, because there's important documents here, then it's divorce separation. Ooh, they're holding back, but they claim that whatever you're telling them is not true, so it's debatable. They're telling you, it's like, come on, I love you. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Sal, you're making me crazy. Jamaica me crazy. <laughs> Welcome to my channel, Sag. And if you're watching from Jamaica, hello, how are you guys? Um, how are you guys doing? I'm Sal. I do the readings here every day. Career finances and your romantic connection. I also teach people how to manifest using different kinds of gemstones and techniques. I have a jewelry store here in Los Angeles, and in case you guys want to check it out. Um, today I'll be teaching you about how to manifest for the coming 2024 at the same time. What to wear, not to wear. Now, what's more what to wear? <laughs> All right. Let's see. Ace of Swords. With a crown. I mean what I say and I say what I mean. I'm done with them. Then why are you here? That's my question. I don't know. Entertainment, Sal? You bring smiles to my life? Okay. Um, I feel like you, you tried to make it work, but then you figured out it is not worth it. Because a ten of swords is like, how much pain? You know? You're lucky that the Tarot never came up with the 11 of swords because you're asking how much pain. It only comes until the 10, and you're lucky there's no 11. The 10 is result. So in numerology, 9 is final, and then outcome is the 10. So the result of you trusting them was painful. 10 of swords. Raise your hand, whoever has been cheated and lied on. This is like, okay, I see a lot of group here. Okay, <laughs> so... There's not enough hands for me to raise. I know. It's okay. It's not okay, Sal. So. Okay. Four of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups right here. Okay. Holding back. Loving you. Are they guilty? No. Do they hate you? No. They shut down. They don't want to talk. And it's giving... I. I feel like your person really has shut down on you and they're just saying, I'm not. I'm not going to talk to you. Not unless it's about love. It's <laughs> Sale, don't tell me that. Well, that's what they have. You're in the cutting. They're in the loving. It's a cup. It's going to be Scorpio. Mm. Okay. Okay, Sale. I'm going to get back to work. No, don't get back to work yet. We're doing the reading. Tell your boss it's like you're busy. Send him an email, you know. I'll get back to you. Okay, we'll, you know, we'll circle back on this. Six of Swords with the Queen of Wands. It's painful to trust someone. You're damn good looking. And you feel like, how can I not see this coming? Okay. Because you're Queen of Wands, you believe in the esoteric and the occult. You're a mystic itself. You manifest, you know what you're doing. However, with regards to this person, it caught you off guard. They're watching you and stalking you and page of swords with the lovers. This is giving... <sighs> lovers is, you, you know, they're connecting with you. This is your seventh house, which is Gemini. You got Leo. Stalking you and wanting some sort of, let's just say, intimate connection. Page of swords? Yep, can be. Mm-hmm. Huh. Conversation, talk, and then lovers. Okay, let's see. You're confused. Oh, well, they're claiming they're confused about your action. And they're giving you, like, the time to think. And uh, you keep running away, though. I feel like Libra had a sim similar read. Libra was running away. Knight of Wands with the Six of Pentacles. Okay. Oh, um. I mean, can you just share with me, Saj, what is a good relationship? What's your idea of a good relationship? How about that? Put it in the comments. Like, what is it? I want to know. I want to pick your brain about it. Because if someone loves you like this person, but then you felt betrayed, so you don't want to commit to them, so it's a done deal. Um, so this is not the kind of relationship, you know, you want something, I don't know, perfect, you know, it's like, oh, good in the picture and everything, you know. Because we do have a lot of uh, things that we learn, you know, dealing with others. And some, of course, are deal breakers. I'm not sure if this person hit the deal breaker for you, you know. 
like for me, I don't know what is a deal breaker for me. I don't know. For me, as long as you, probably you're a good person, then everything is fine. Like as long as you're a good human being. <laughs> that's that's how I would say. Knight of Wands with the Six of Pentacles. Um, for you, it's like it's not enough being a good being. <laughs> Loving me is not enough. Um, what is enough for you? Because your person is trying to figure you out, but they can't. They can't understand you. Seven of Cups with the Four of Swords. No matter what they do, according to them, they're so puzzled. Uh, well, with the four, Seven of Cups with the Four of Swords right now, they don't understand. The number one thing that people are looking for in their entire life is their soulmate. The remedy that I give them, wear a red thread bracelet. Can I name drop? Rihanna's been wearing this one for a very long time. In just the first hour, hundreds of order with a red thread bracelet. If I was you and you're looking for a soulmate, visit our website, eatreadlove.me. Order one today. Yeah, they don't understand. You keep avoiding them even though they tell you the, you know, the feelings that they have. Okay. Let me see. Ooh, they're rushing to talk. Okay, here. Oh, they claim that it is not fair. This is not fair. This is what your person, they, they, we gotta work this out. This is not fair. You know what is not fair, but is fair. Well, today we just got our 14 karat real gold. I've been working on this one for the past six months, a new collection of a red thread. This comes from Spain. I'm wearing the Hamsa with a turkey evil eye. Yes. And don't forget, if you get anything from our holiday collection, this was on sale, you get our eternity real gold, okay, handmade, okay. Um, this is your charmed bracelet. So this one is free, but you can get this also, of course, on its own. But I would get this one. Oh, I'm doing this one. Ugh. I just love the Hamsa, okay? And we ship to more than 80 countries across the globe. And it is this one, Forever Fortune, free shipping in the US if you get this, okay? Let's see here. I'll teach you more about manifestation and my mantras that I've been doing to program our mind for the coming 2024. Wheel of Fortune in the Moon. You are going around in circles with this person and you don't like it. And it was never really clear about their intention. Now that they're trying to clear it, you don't want it. Eight of Pentacles to the King of Pentacles. You're trying to focus on your wealth and abundance. Um, Wheel of Fortune with the Moon. You're waiting for a big break over here. This is cash flow. So either you expect something big this coming month, which is, of course, it's your, um, your birthday month, right? Your solar return. But this is fated. Moon is nurturing. So where are you going? What are you doing? Okay. Huh. There's... Mm. I have to say there's a gap between the two of you, but there's not. I feel like there's an excuse between the two of you. Because you're telling your person, you're saying, I'm busy at work. I don't really have time for these mind games. I've talked to you before, and you're always giving me the same story. Huh. But your person is not giving you the same story. I don't think so. Because they have the Knight of Swords here. The Knight of Swords is really expressing the truth. Page of, it's not apologetic though. It's more of like, what do you want? What, do you, what else do you want from me? So it's more of like proving. But you're moving now with the chariot. Either the ship has sailed. Chariot with the Wheel of Fortune. You thought about it. It's like, if I'm done with you, I'm done with you. You know, there's no amount of convincing. I feel like Libra has very similar. Wheel of Fortune and the Chariot and the Moon. So some of you guys are thinking about buying a new car or relocating. Now, when um, when you're trying to relocate over here, let me see if there's about okay. Yep, it can be foreign travel. Wheel of Fortune. Okay. If you are trying to go abroad, okay, uh, I'm not sure if I have a Piao that has lapis lazuli. I feel like I have, and it's called Prosperity. Now, only if you are trying to travel abroad. Lapis lazuli with Piao. Oh, don't ask me why. You can take me later. Okay. Lapis lazuli with Piao. Okay. okay. That's why I said I don't know if I have... But I know lapis lazuli is good for foreign travel. 
And then the Piao, of course, remove blockages and obstacles. Mm. Page of Pentacles, they're very sorry. And then you have a star card over here, Divine Timing. They're waiting for a moment for you to accept their apology. The star and the wheel of, and the moon over here, everything is lining up for the two of you to have a talk. Ooh. But there's nothing going on in Gemini right now in your seventh house. Sag, Cap, Aqua, Pisces, Aries. Nothing going on. Oh, no. Nothing going on in your fifth house. Not at all. I mean, there is a lot of... Oh, Rahu is in the fifth. Sag, Cap, Aqua, Pisces, Aries. No, Rahu is in the fourth now for you. Jupiter, yes, is in Aries. And that's actually the Karka for kids, yes. Spouse, yes. You've been dating, can be. You're very creative, I see that. You know what I'm seeing for you, Sag? It's like you have a lot on your plate and you haven't really pinned down if you still want this connection. But everything is lining up to, you know, like with the star card here for the two of you, star and the lovers. I'm not sure if you guys are a happy couple-ish, you know, then I would suggest the couple one because we have a couple one for this one. Mm. So exchange gifts, strengthen the bond. I love a good relationship, meaning when I see people having it. And I feel like this is one of those, but I guess the two of you right now, you know, at least you, you don't want to talk. It's okay. Not judging you. You've been hurt by them so many times, nine of ones with the three of cups. That's just right now, I just can't forgive, forgive Sal. Everything has to stop. It is what you're saying. Well, I feel like the, the saga will continue of nine of cups, three of ones with the five pentacles. No contact, no communication. Mm. Make sure to check out our website, e 3 Tomorrow we'll touch this subject again.